Hey there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany Bundles and today's video is going to be a review on the Melody Susie nail drill. Uh, I'm excited to create this video. I'm really um, just eager to share with you how my experience has been using this drill and also doing my nails at home. I'm not a professional, um, but when lockdown occurred, I had a few decisions to make. You know, I had to decide if I wanted to take my nails off and wait until the nail shops open, or if I wanted to go ahead and purchase the tools necessary for me to be able to do my nails at home. And so that's what I decided to do. I decided to go on Amazon and purchase tools and, you know, polish and things that I needed to actually do my nails from home. So I've used this drill about uh, probably three to four times now, and I just got done using it to, to do a fill. Um, on myself and so I want to you know just sh share with you all my experience and kind of show you what it looks like so if you are interested in this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up please make sure that you are subscribed and let's get right into the video so this is what the drill looks like this is pretty much how it came the charger was included um, like in this package as well it's just the charger is pretty um I don't want to say it's too big to fit in there, but you know how things are. Once you take them out of its like original packaging way or design, sometimes it's harder to put things back in the exact way that you got them. So I keep my charger out. I really don't like to, um, you know, to wrap any chargers or mess with the charger too much because I don't want to cause a short. Um, so one of the things that really attracted me to this drill was the drill color. Um, it's kind of like a purplish, I thought it was going to be pink, but it's kind of like a purplish color. Um, I really like it. I decided to film this video outside on my back porch. That way you all can see the true color of the drill as well. And I'm working with one hand. I'm holding, you know, the camera with one hand and I'm recording with the, you know, using my other hand to show you what the drill looks like. So please bear with me. But this is what the drill looks like up close. It does say Melody Susie on it. Um, and of course, it's a portable drill. So I can take this drill wherever I want with me. Um, I've been doing my nails outside lately just for more ventilation. And, um, you know, it's just it's really been easy to navigate and move from room to room um, doing my nails with this drill. Um, some drills, I believe, take batteries. Some take chargers. I just knew that I wanted a drill that was, you know, going to accept a charger. That way I don't really have to worry about it dying on me or worry about me having to replace batteries. I prefer drills with chargers. Um, this is not my first drill. I've had a drill. I purchased a drill like a few years ago. Um, and every time that I purchase a drill, I think I've purchased a drill maybe like maybe three to four times in my life. But every time that I purchase a drill, I want to make sure that it's comfortable for me to hold. Um, for anyone that's wondering, I am right handed, but I do both of my, you know, both of my hands, obviously. Um, there are some people that are like, you know, I don't do nails because I can't do the other hand or the other hand is really, it makes it difficult for me to do. And what I would say to that is just try to find, like play around with a couple of drills and try to find like the curve appeal that works best for you and, and you know, the way that you do your nails because everyone has a different way of how they do their nails. Um, it feels really comfortable in my hand though. I pretty much just hold it like it's a pencil or like it's a marker. I'm also gonna show you what it comes with. So it comes with um, different sanding bands. It comes with actually a lot of sanding bands. Um, I don't wanna say different. They're the same type of sanding bands, um, I believe. Uh, as far as I could see, but you know, it comes with a lot of sanding bands and it also comes with different tools. So you have, you know, different tools that help you shape your nails and smooth your nails and file, you know, different polish off or um, kind of get your nails um, to be flush and to be smooth like you like them. But I was just shocked that I actually got this many sanding bands included with the drill. Um, the drill was at actually under $30. I believe it's like $28.99. I purchased it from Amazon. And um, I believe shipping would have been a lot faster if we didn't have all of those shipping delays. But even with the shipping delays, I didn't have to wait too long. So I was really appreciative for that. Um, like I mentioned, I did use this drill about three to four times. I just got done using the drill and I didn't wipe off all of the residue. So you may see some residue on the drill and also on, you know, the, the pieces that come along with it. Um, excuse me, I don't know the exact terminology for each tool, but you can see the residue just to show you that I've, you know, I've actually 
use this product. I didn't want to go ahead and do a review without me using the product. Uh, one thing, another thing that I really, really enjoy about using this drill is the fact that it doesn't overheat. Um, some drills that I've had get really, really hot after I've been drilling for a moment. You know, I have longer curved nails, as you can see, and I need a drill that doesn't get hot because I'm going to be doing a lot of drilling. You know, the longer my nails get, um, I also like my nails to be thick. I like them to be like a certain way. So I use my drill religiously. Um, or I am going to be using it religiously. I have been using it religiously since I bought it. Like I said, I've used it about three to four times. And I just want to make sure that I'm using a drill that's not overheating um, because that, that can make it uncomfortable to actually do your nails. You know, you start filing your nails and then it gets hot and you have to sit it down and, you know, wait for the drill to cool off. And I don't, I don't want to do that. I want to make sure that I have a drill that I'm able to use until I'm done using it for that point, just so I can get done with my nails. I can say the two things that really are not fun or not my favorite parts about doing my nails is the time that it takes and also um you know the smell from like filing and the gel polish and things like that which you know that has nothing to do with the drill but i'm just saying so i don't want a drill that's going to prolong that process or prolong me doing my nails so the fact that i can kind of get everything done in a timely fashion because the drill that i'm showing you in this video does not overheat is a bonus you also have an option to choose the speeds you can choose to turn off the drill um you know by using these options here or turn it on. I'm going to actually flip it over for you so you can see what I'm referring to. I believe it goes up to 20,000 RPG for the speed, which is great for me. I typically start off, like if I'm taking off my gel polish, I'll use like a probably like a low speed setting and then I increase the speed setting as I need it depending on what I'm doing. If I'm shaping, if I'm trying to, you know, um, really get in there, if I'm trying to, um, you know, clean under my nails because maybe, you know, gel has um, dried under there and it's not smooth whatever the case may be I like the fact that there's different speed options because there's different things that I need this drill to do to make my nails look you know look like I want them to look so this is what it looks like like I mentioned it is portable um, so I'm able to like take this wherever I, I need to take it with me there's not too much involved with taking this to one location to another um, another thing that I like about this drill is the fact that the pieces like you know the pieces that I'm showing you on the bottom right of the screen or in the bottom right of the screen um, it's not hard to enter like change out the pieces there are some drills that i've used where it will be really hard to put in like you know change the different pieces that you're wanting to use with your drill um, and it's also really hard to kind of like pull them out um, and then i've also used drills where um, i've been filing away or drilling away and then the piece would like come off and i've got hurt that way too now i'm not saying that you know it wasn't user error or you know, maybe I did something wrong. Um, but the fact that this is that has not happened to me with this drill is a big bonus in my book. Um, I don't feel like the piece is going to fall out. It never has come out while I've been drilling. Um, if I turn it upside down, it's it's secure in there. And like I said, one, even though it's secure in there, it's not hard for me to take the piece out and change it to another piece or just take it out when I'm completely done and put it back. When I put up my drill, I kind of put it back the same way that it was shipped to me minus the charger being in the the box um, i kind of keep my charger outside of the box i really don't wrap it too many times because i don't want to cause a short i just put it somewhere in my office um you know along kind of close to the box but not in the box of that you know hopefully that makes sense hopefully i painted a good visual but it's really easy to kind of put everything back up exactly how it came and that's really how i use it um so I like it. I think it's a great investment. Typically, um, I would spend like maybe 50 to like $65, $70 for a fill um, each time I would go to the shop. And so using this drill along with my UV light and, you know, some gel polish has really been saving me tons of money. And I don't know if I am going to go back to the nail shop as much as I used to uh, when it does open back up just because I'm kind of getting the hang of doing it myself. And I found different tools and different techniques that work well for me. So if you are someone and you're like, hey, I really want to do my nails, I miss my nails or, you know, I just want to go ahead and, and try doing my nails myself. I want to take this up, take this on as a challenge or as a hobby or, you know, something that I, I want to do, um, then I would definitely look at, you know, invest in this tool this is not sponsored this is completely you know it's, it's coming from me this is my review this is just my um, experience using the melody Susie 
and all I can say is good things. I hope this video helped. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.